Hello everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to my playthrough of Outland. We are in the last era of the game still, which is called Eternity, and I just fucked it up. So pretty much I beat a whole level and like half of the other, I don't know. This is called the Tower of Eternity. Alright, see how it is. I have to do some switching in me there. Not the most fun thing to do, clearly. Okay, they gave me another checkpoint pretty soon. Isn't it better to die now? Honestly, yeah, it's a very good idea. So fighting with a dragon, surrounded by bullets, that's kind of assy. Let me see what's down here. Money. Oh, I didn't remember actually the dragon uh, fired a laser of the different color. From the dragon itself. Oh, what the hell? I will blame this somehow on the background again because uh, you can barely see enemies, red enemies, with this background. Probably you can tell on the recording. You can, you are able to differentiate the colors without any problem. But on the TV, trust me, it's a different story. Alright, I, I didn't get the pattern quite much, and I was about to die anyway, so that's that's okay, I guess. I wasted a lot of health fighting the dragon, I guess I will have to use all this heavy attack power. Remember, the dragon also changes color, as just like the rest of the enemies, basically. Alright, at least I lost less health this time. Fucker. Made me switch color precisely when I wa didn't want to. Okay, what was on this side? I never explored. I just went up there and ended up getting killed by those bullets. Yeah, fuck it. Heavy attack. Wow, I'm about to die again? That's so fast. And I didn't even know where I was going. I wasn't even paying attention to the flies. Because in the previous in the other attempt I went up there and now I decided to go down, but well, we will find out now. Trying to suck less, obviously. Yeah, now we are using the heavy attacks right away in order to lose as least health as possible against the dragon. There we go. Oh. Up here is where I'm supposed to go. So, I honestly wonder, what's the point of trying to get more money? I have too much money right now. And as I said in the previous part, I'm not even sure if there will be more upgrades in the game. But if they are, I have enough money at least to buy one of them. Even the two of them. Because I'm near the... The hundred thousand. Ninety-two, well... Okay. That was the, the end of the second area of Eternity. Now let's go to Trail of Tears. And as usual, I start a new level with pretty much no health. I can just go kill myself if I wanted, but I would like to get to know the level a little bit better. Oh, you cannot destroy those? Okay, I thought there was a little secret down here. 
kill each other. Thank you. And there is a switch. Oh yeah, the one at the beginning. Right there. What's up here? More money, I assume. See, I'm pretty close to the 100,000. Oops. Oh shit, it's this guy. I don't think I'm gonna make it with three hearts only. At least I found, yeah, uh, the proper method to fight him. You can use this super laser power in order to save time, but you'll have to use special attack for that. Okay, I don't know what killed me. I think I touched the shield. Who knows? But yeah, I had very little help for me to fight him properly, so I'm gonna try again. I have to ghost hit the switch again. Yeah, I'm going for this money again, why not? If I die again before a checkpoint, probably I won't bother. Okay, here we are. I ended up using the uppercut, and now I use the laser too late. It's not a good thing, obviously. I, I ended up... Yeah, I'm using the uppercut again. Just... Stand still. There we go. I did even had time to use the laser with this... Okay. I ran out of space, so I better kill him fast. Oh, he's changing pattern. The famous desperate move when, you know, they're about to get killed. Well, I lost half of my health. Not too bad. Couldn't be worse. Let me see if we can get some heart. Perfect. That's all I wanted. Oh no, these guys. I don't see any checkpoint nearby. So even after the mini boss battle you need to keep your health. Take us very little hits if you can. But the game is generous enough to give you a lot of hearts from enemies even. So yeah, you have to worry but not too much. Yeah, I would like to take care of this guy. Yeah, heavy attack to kill the both of them. Oh shit. The flight enemy is a little bit distracting too. This is just a matter of timing, though. Go. Alright, there's the checkpoints. Ah, 
And that's the door for the final boss, but I still have to find the garden key. Alright, this looks a little bit complicated. Not because of the bullet patterns, it's because of the enemies. Now I think I'm gonna die. Yep. Well, it, it's for the better though, because I just hit the checkpoint with very little health. And now we can try again. I never use the teleporting thing. Probably that would be good in case you need to backtrack and get some upgrade that you couldn't afford in a previous area. So basically that teleport allows you to save time. Probably that's what it does. Honestly, I don't want to like use the recording or anything to find out such thing. I'm just gonna risk it with, with what I currently have. How's that? Whatever, keep moving. Oh, dragon in the middle of bullets again. Oh, I can just hit him while he's blue or use... Well, that's bullshit. Okay. Special attacks all the time. While being red. Nice. Three special attacks are enough for, kill for killing the dragon. And there's another checkpoint even. So, much better. Launch pads. Yeah, those are easy to to pass by. Oh, that's not even the way to go. <laughs> there was another heart waiting for me. Yeah, I needed to go up here. That was weird. Alright, there is more than one path, which I assume is for getting more money. The end of all things. Okay, I'm gonna stop the video here. Next time, I'm gonna try to get the garden key and get to the boss's area. So, thanks a lot for watching.